this is YBR and this is my air conditioning unit. And I have a separate air conditioner in here because it gets really hot in this room because I have a lot of computers in here. If I was to try to cool this room with the central air, it'd be about 90 degrees Fahrenheit in here and a nice cool 70 through the rest of the house. So it's pretty important to have this thing and it's been working all right for a while, but now it's not working all right. As you can see right here, there is a pretty serious issue. Yeah, right there. Drip, 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 drip. Oh, it's so annoying and it drips so much. Like it never stops. It just keeps going and going and going and look where it actually goes. Okay, so we're going to zoom out a bit. And we're just gonna follow the drip down. So where does the drip go? Oh look, it goes right next to a server. It is literally inches from the power supply on the server. If it was a couple of inches to the left, it would be dropping onto the power supply. And that means we're mixing water and electricity, which is always a fun thing to do. And if we keep going down, oh look, a catch tub to catch the water. So it doesn't ruin the floor, except it already has a little bit because I had no idea what the noise was at first. I'm like, what's that noise? I don't know, I'm going to bed, and I wake up, and it's like, oh, well, it's all wet over here. That's what the noise was. And here's something fun. You see that computer right there? It used to be where that catch tub was. So that computer's all wet. Somehow it still works. I have no idea how. I am super thankful for the fact that it still works, but I can't believe this. It was literally dripping directly onto the computer. So now I got liquid cooling on the outside of the case as well. This is great. So I got to deal with this today because I can't just leave this dripping. It is just driving me insane because you hear it. Like, if I'm recording a video, you're going to hear it going drip, drip, drip in between the words. And oh my goodness, it's so annoying. I had to scrap a whole video because I was just like, I'm going to ignore the dripping and hopefully I can record a video as it drips in the tub. Nope. Even with a rag in the tub, it didn't help. So why is it dripping? Well, if we look closely, it's really obvious. So we're going to get up in here and you see we have a soft tube going into a hard PVC pipe. And all they do is tape it, it looks like. And you can actually see inside of the PVC pipe right there. That's what that white spot is. I have no idea how it held. For as long as it did, I'm just going to try to add more tape. But to add more tape, we got to remove all of the plastic. And I'm just going to be using regular old duct tape here. I don't have the fancy black tape they have. I have electrical tape, but it's really thin. And where am I going to be standing to do this? Well, I got one foot on the computer that was all wet and still slippery. And the other foot is on a computer chair that's sliding all over the place. Yeah, I'm probably going to seriously injure myself in this whole project. We're mixing electricity, water, and unstable surfaces. This is great. You know what? I should probably upload this video before I start doing anything else. Just in case, if you never have another video from me, you know how I died. Anyways, I just had to show you guys what was going on here because I am so shocked that this computer still works and I might be shocked literally if everything doesn't go according to plan. If this computer right here gets wet, we're screwed. And I'm pointing with my foot again. Pointing with your foot works really good, except now I have one foot on a moving chair and I'm holding a camera and I'm probably gonna fall. Anyways, that's all for this video. Hopefully I don't die in the project. Until next time, it's YBR. I'll see ya.